Hey guys and welcome back to Resident Evil 2 Remake, you're here with Tom Tony and in the last part we beat William Birkin and we don't need anything in here and we uh, we went underground and we're just about to uh, go back into the police station car park Lower it. FBI. Sorry. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> For your help. I'm surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry, that information is classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. Hey! I'm not done talking to you! Let's go follow her. About that, guys, I got a bit of a sore throat today. Uh, we'll take this. Not that we really need it. Now, we want to kill this guy because else he wakes up. I believe it's always a critical hit. But yeah, we don't want him waking up uh, when we come back through here. Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I don't know the same thing to him, I guess. Hey, I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage. Believe me. Sorry. I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. Look, we're both prisoners in the station. So either we play nice and help each other out. Shh. It's coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on. Don't be an asshole. Hey, you need this. Just get me the fuck out of here. Who is that? It's just me. So we can put that thing away. I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? You knew him? He was an informant. I had information of use to my investigation. So what he said was true? 
Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. I'm Leon Kennedy. Find a way out, Leon. Before it's too late. Then we'll talk. Name's Ada. Well, I guess the deal's on. <laughs> so we need that. Memo. Jail power, power panel. The power panel is out. Can the person in charge of it please take care of it ASAP? I assume everyone knows, but since the jail's power panel is so old, we're going to need those custom power panel parts. No one makes any more. There should be a few in the generator room. <coughs> Addendum. I got word that there's only one of those power panel parts in the generator, in the generator room. The guy that's here to fix the valve in the clock tower should have the another. So someone swipe. I mean, ask him nicely for it, please. Okay. I believe that's everything in here. Dogs in here now? No. Equipment disposal notice. Item to to be disposed. Key to patrol car seven four three nine. Details. Bent key no longer usable, but can still open the car's doors and trunk with its keyless entry button. Buttons. Which is in this box. Taki. Do I have another knife? I don't think I do, do I? I don't know why I was going there for an item box. And uh, those are little, like little collectibles. Um, I won't be getting them all because I can't remember where they all are. But a message from Mr. Raccoon. Howdy, boys and girls. It's your pal from Raccoon City Zoo. It's always great to see you. Today I want to talk about something really important to me. You know my popular Mr. Raccoon toys? Well, I heard some bad kids have been using them for target practice. But that makes me really sad. Good little kids wouldn't be that mean, right? Plus, it's super, super dangerous. So don't do it. Anyway, see you at the zoo, Mr. Raccoon out. So obviously we're gonna we're gonna be shooting them. <laughs> but yeah, I I know where a few of them are, but I don't know where all of them are. So all right, in here we use this key to unlock the police car, which I never did in my first run because. I was I was going around looking for the the number of the uh, key, the number of the car, but we don't need that. Yeah, that's everything. No, it's not a light switch.
Okay. So I want to kill these dogs. A couple of shots should kill them, because else they do break out and become a pain. Oh, I missed. Here. Autopsy record number 53477. Name of deceased, Justin Hansen, male, Caucasian, 39 years old, observation, found dead in the jail cell bed by staff. Hands are still clenched tightly due to rigor mortis, which should be coming to an end. It's highly likely that he died just after lights out. Deceased was a known kleptomaniac. Um, Incarc incarcerated multiple times, incredibly, he would steal even while in jail, though that, oh, sorry, sorry guys, <laughs> though that was consistent with his clinical diagnosis. Oh, I got to stay. Just so I don't get um, swallowed by a, a zombie. Right, you can stay down there. Okay. Way more ammo than it should have, and there's still something in here apparently. There's a flash grenade, which is perfect. Okay, so a similar puzzle to the original game, and I believe it's just that. <laughs> a 
And now we can get back upstairs. And now we run for our lives. Ah, oh, so that's uh, a little, a little oh, jump hit. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, that's a little jumpy when uh, when you got headphones on. First time I played this game, and the many times after that to play them, it I didn't have headphones on. Oh. Okay, come on. Locker, which I've already done. <laughs> Is that everything? Yeah. So we'll put that away, take that out. No, I don't have any defense items. Take that out, put that away. I'll take another one out as well. That one, put that away. Uh, I think I need everything else. Actually, I could put that away until we get back into there. Oh. <laughs> Did not know that was there. Okay, so there's another one just here. Worst thing is, I knew they were there. I can't see him. Okay. No, it's not. Get off me. Son of a 
bitch. Okay. Um, that took a lot of health. So I'm going to use one of them. Because there are plenty of herbs in this game. So I don't want to be running around uh, wounded. Clearing this out. I don't what? want uh, any trouble with uh, what comes out. Oh god! They really are bullet sponges, though. This way, I believe. There's another one. Uh, have I still got that key on me? Yes. Oh, it's a club key, not a diamond. Nothing else to pick up. I know there's a blue herb, which 
which I suppose can be missed. Well, that wasn't held together very well, was it? Well, there was some ammo on that. Okay, perfect. Right, what I'm going to do is make some ammo because I'm running low. And that is all I have time for today guys. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It would be greatly appreciated. And I will see you in the next part. See ya.